recently NASA patented self-sacrificing cannibalizing spacecrafts and they are awesome. Let's check that out. NASA has patented spacecrafts that can perform self-sacrifice for the greater good. For future space missions, NASA has planned to change its strategy from sending a single spacecraft per mission to sending a swarm of spacecrafts per mission, something like what we saw in the Star Wars series. A space mission is returning to Earth from the edge of the solar system The space mission includes a swarm of spacecrafts. The individual spacecrafts in the swarm are designed to automatically perform their assigned roles. When the spacecraft swarm reaches Saturn, a solar flare on the sun shoots out a solar storm in the direction of the swarm. One of the spacecrafts designed to detect such threats detects and monitors the approaching solar storm. It then autonomously decides to shield other spacecrafts using its solar sail. In the process, its solar sail is completely destroyed, rendering the spacecraft useless. The surrounding spacecrafts then turn cannibalistic and automatically salvage any usable parts of the sacrificing spacecraft. For example, a neighboring spacecraft detaches solar panels from the sacrificing spacecraft. Another spacecraft pumps out the rocket fuel. Yet another one drains out battery power from the sacrificing spacecraft. Alternatively, the sacrificing spacecraft may donate its usable parts to other spacecrafts before sacrificing itself. Clearly, NASA is planning to enter the next era of space exploration. We at Parent Yogi wish NASA best of luck. Until next time, keep innovating and keep parenting. If you like to stay updated on future technology trends, do subscribe to our channel by clicking the big red button. Or video can be recorded and stored on the device or automatically be transmitted to any local authorities, police or your friends. So that can help to define the attacker. For example, you can then just uh, speak and describe the attacker.